Who's ready for some hot? Hi, everybody. James Sabalski for EA Sports. Some of the best squads on the planet ready to collide on the ice. Both teams seem ready, and they're about to drop the puck on this opening faceoff. The Canadians are going to start with the puck after taking the opening draw. Moves behind the net. Here he is, wrestling on net. Too much congestion in front. Here he is, in close. Big save by the goaltender watching that one. As the goaltender, you have to... He scores! That's how you do it. Leadership to a T. The captain capitalizes. In a high danger scoring area, he's got a bit of time, but he knows he's gonna have coverage come to him right away. So a quick snapshot, and he buries it. The Canadians have to be feeling good about this start here, Cheryl. Yeah, I know it's not rocket science, James, but you certainly play different when you have the lead than when you don't. And when you're the away team and setting the tone, that's a good start. Dreisaitl's going to play it from the back of the cage. He scores! That's fast, James. A pair of goals in 40 seconds. Anybody who just got up for a quick snack is probably looking at the scoreboard goal. What happened? Well, don't blink. The game can change in an instant. Absolutely. The goalie coaches work all the time with one screen or one player in front, James, and he's got to do a good job of finding this puck. I mean, it just beats him clean. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. The Canadians now lead by two. And they grab possession of the puck after that center ice face off. The Canadians will take it behind the net. Here's a blast! And that's deflected off someone in front. And a strong effort on that play. And another save! Scores! And that's tipped in! No, James, I think this is being disallowed. It's going to be a high sticking. They'll review this to confirm the call. The call on the ice is no goal. They're going to go upstairs. Let's see what the review is. Man, does he ever make this goal look easy, James. And it is tougher than it looks. Trust me. That puck is elevated. It's in the air. So your timing with your stick to be able to make contact and enough force to put that thing in the net, it ain't easy. All right, both teams ready for the face-off after that lengthy review. The Canadians have been off to a fantastic start here in this opening period. And off the draw, they kick the puck. Oh, what a hit against the boards! Executed perfectly, James. I mean, he can't maneuver. He's got nowhere to go. He's lined up, and then he's taken down. Kadri slugging the puck. And he's pulled over to the ice and loses the puck. Some heat, James, but he was able to get in front of it and turn it aside. Goes to the paint. There's another stop. Man, is he ever quick on his feet, anticipating the play. Excellent reflexes. He's saving his team right now. The Canadians have been all over them, and there's still plenty of time left in this first. Lemuse won the face off here in the offensive zone. Scooped up along the wall by Yossi. Great pressure with the stick. Bumped off the puck. Puck behind the net. Fires it. And he comes up with a stop there. Quick feed down low. And there's a shot. Oh, what a big time stop by Joseph. Getting closer to the halfway point of this frame. The Canadians have dominated this one to this point. They lead it 3 0. Scores! Rips that off the pipe and into the net. Wow! You almost needed a double take there, James. When you hear that sound, sometimes you think it's out, but this one goes in. This is why you practice that play, James. You're in the offensive zone and you got to make the most of it with a key win. Everyone knows their responsibilities. They take it to the net and it's a great goal. The Canadians have used their advantage in shots to take the lead here in the first. Lemuse won the draw inside the neutral zone. They'll go to work offensively here. Here's a shot. Oh, what a save on the play. Wow. Oh, that's Grand Larceny, James. I mean, he just stole one away from his opponent. What a save. Setters glide into the D 
done as a face-off ready to resume play. Lemieux won the face-off, and now let's see what they can do. Campbell's got it in the defensive end. Over the line they come. Takes the puck at the point. Oh, major league block on the play. Yossi's picking up steam. Here's a chance. Scores! And the pylon continues, and these home fans, I think, have had about enough. Yeah, they have had enough, and they make money, and they're leaving the building. Why? Because they are frustrated with their team, just a lack of effort today, and just getting blown out of the water. The Canadians came hungry to play this one, and they lead as a result here in the first. McDavid's quick stick lands him the puck here at center. Moves the puck along the half wall. Here he is from the slot. Oh, a clutch save. Oh, and it's a big save on the play. What a great job of tracking the puck. Not one, but two consecutive saves. Here in the back half of this period, the Canadians have really extended this lead. It's looking like a squash now. And they'll start with possession. Along the half wall with the puck. Here's the rope. And the goaltender comes up with a piece of it to keep it out of the net. The Canadians have it now. And he takes the pass. On the attack along the boards. Shot! And that's stopped by Joseph. Deneau stick handling in his own zone. Now a quick pass to Samuelson. Who's the puck? The Canadians gain possession in their own end. Swap up, let's go! Fires it on net. That's wide of the net. Picked up along the wall by Orlov. Dreisaitl's last play was a tough one, James. He loses his balance, which makes it difficult for him to corral the puck and get it off with precision, but he makes the play. Hamilton's got the puck along the wing. And now he moves it quickly to Strom. Tremendous save by Hellebuck. Ahead of steam now towards the front. The Flames get a hold of the puck. The Canadians have it against the wall. Solid save by Joseph. Great positioning by the goaltender to redirect it to the corner, getting it out of danger. Through the neutral zone and into the offensive end. Great use of the body to knock him off the puck. And there's a shot, and that doesn't reach the net. Makes a move in front, and he comes up with the save. Hammers a shot, and he's going to pounce on it from a whistle and get a stoppage in play and much needed at that. I can't overstate how timely important that this cover is, James. When you're on your heels and you're chasing the game, you need a reset button. Goaltender allows it to happen. The Canadians have a big lead already here as we near the end of period number one. They have certainly come to shine tonight. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Oh, a stick save and a butte. Well, fun start to this one as period number one comes to an end. We've still got lots more still in store. Kids are coming out on the ice here to play the little mini prospects game. And we'll be back with more in a moment. going to be able to return to the game, James. I mean, that injury that he suffered earlier is going to keep him out. This is that tough loss for their team. No, and you clearly kind of know where you stand from a coaching standpoint now, but that is a serious blow to the lineup here for the rest of the game. And he gets just enough to keep it out. Yeah. And he puts home his own rebound. Well, this is a second effort, and everyone on the bench erupts when he scores this goal, James. Why? Because he's tenacious on the play. He doesn't just shoot the puck. He finds his own rebound that's a great play. The 
Canadians have already created a mismatch here tonight when you look at the scoreboard, Cheryl, but they're not taking the foot off the gas. Well, they're not, and every time they have an opportunity to shoot, they're putting it to the net. And a lot of confidence for every player here when they get the puck into that offensive zone, the reason why they got such a heavy lead. Just a little too much contact and couldn't hang on to the puck. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Kucherov's going to play it against the half wall. Picked up along the boards by Mitchell. Hyman's got it on the offensive end. All oh, the officials saw that trip, and the hand is up. Moves it to Stahl. Stopped by the goaltender. He got a little piece of that one. Time for the officials to hand out the judgment. Dreisaitl's been nabbed for tripping. Well, this gives us our first chance to take a look at the team's power play unit. First power play opportunity of the game. You know they've worked on this in practice to set up the look that they want. Let's see how they move the puck around the perimeter and look to attack. Quick shot! And that's blocked. The Flames gain possession along the wall. Tries to get it to Comfort. With some open space here in the neutral zone. Oh, a huge hit against the wall, and you know who felt that one. Well, and that's a tone setter. That's sending a message to every player on your team. Scores! Well, how's that for killing a penalty? That's turning a PK into a power kill, James. Not just shooting it down the ice. Your time and space. Take advantage with a shorty. Well, I'd say they're running out of options here, James. I mean, they took their starter out. They brought him in in relief. And unfortunately, just not getting the job done as that one goes by. You know who else is not getting the job done? The team in front of them. The Canadians look about as dominant as I have seen them all season here, Cheryl. This period has been unbelievable. Yeah, they're dictating pace and they're dictating the play all over the ice. And then they're executing on their opportunities. It's a reason why they hold the lead. Retrieves the puck trying to kickstart this power play. The Flames have time for one last rush here on this power play. This is a tough power play sequence. Unable to get it into the offensive zone, and the crowd certainly doesn't like it. Booing all over the place. The Flames' man advantage comes to an end, and not the result they were looking for, giving up a shorty. The expectation when you're on the power play is to score a goal, not give up one, James. This is a tough one to take for this group. The Canadians played along the wing. Dobson's got it to the side. And the puck dies with the trapper save. We know the goaltender was set to this position, square to the shooter, to be able to make that club save. The Canadians lead in a big way here in this second. They have been on fire offensively. Lemuse won the draw there on the attack. Here's a shot. Oh, and he steps up with the club to stop that one. The Canadians continue to lead in the second. They have been the busier team in the shot department, and as a result, they lead. Lemieux's got the puck, and they'll go on the attack. Moves inside! Now they'll look to 
see what they can do with it offensively. Oh, that's right off the mask. Still to come, third period action right after we get a clean sheet of ice.
Welcome back, everyone. Both teams lined up at center ice, and we are ready to get this third period underway. We are underway here in the third. Let's see if there's any sort of saving face at one end of the ice. Well, two periods down. Here we go with the third period. Cheryl, your assessment so far. The Canadians have a comfortable lead here in the third period, James. They do not have to change a thing. Don't alter the game plan. Just close it out. Oh, gets a pat on that one. What a stop by Hellebuck. Ah, he's reading these shooters so well. He's getting in front of them. He's aggressive. And he's challenging them to beat him, James. And that's what I love about him. A ton of confidence. Through center along the wing. Into the corner now. From point blank range. Makes a save. Gets a piece of it with the glove. Sometimes goaltenders just make it... The Canadians get a hold of the puck along the boards. Yossi's got it in the corner. Blocked yeah. in front. The Canadians ready to go on the attack. Denies him! Oh, what a save with the glove! And he'll hang on to the puck for a much-needed whistle. Well, and this is huge, James. The ability to slow the game down, get a line change. There's no one happier than the coach right now. Face-off coming up. They can smell blood here, I think. Yeah, they need to put their foot on the gas pedal because they recognize that the goaltender, he was under siege, James, and he really didn't get a chance to get much rest. Parisi's moving it ahead. And he maintains possession of the puck here. Handles the pass at center. Lemieux's team is flying out there, James. I mean, this is a blowout. He already has one. How many more is he going to get? And he came up with a solid stop on that play. nature of his team tonight but man does he make a nice save there and that's showing that he's emotionally engaged he's staying prepared even though he hasn't been busy puck scooped up by Doughty through the neutral zone up along the wing shot denies him in close quick feed to Deneau picking up steam in the offensive zone Deneau's going to play to the corner here's a chance big time saving goal with the stick. Moves it around along the half wall. Oh, 
just goes off his glove and it stays out. Shot, and that caroms off a body in the lane. Scooped up along the wall by Hamilton. The Canadians have it now. Good use of the body to knock them off the puck. Strom swooping in on the attack. The Canadians get a hold of the puck in their own end. Skates in behind the cage. Fires it on net. Oh, the night on the play. Wow. Oh, that's a true competitor's save. Just when you think that he's completely out of it, James, he comes across with a desperation save to keep his team alive. Goes right to the crease. takes the puck, gains the zone. Nugent Hopkins setting up against the wall. Big time stop. Driving right to the front. And they'll get a breather as the goaltender covers it up. The Canadians have definitely used the shoot first mentality and look at the score here late. Lemieux won the draw and they'll look to set up. Takes the puck. And that's a great heads up play in the offensive zone. Picked up along the boards by Lemieux. And a nice takeaway in the defensive end by Comper. Works it across to Pavelski. With possession along the wall. And talk about a hostile environment as the final seconds tick away. The Canadians have been a lot of fun to watch tonight. Lots of offensive scoring chances, and they have capitalized late right here in this third. Off the draw, they take possession. Lemieux has been winning the matchup in the middle on the faceoff. This is a stat you want to be ahead in because your team starts with the puck. Covers it up, and we'll get a stoppage in play. Official signals for the players to get into position, and we're about ready to drop the puck. And off the draw, they'll take possession. Offside the call, we'll get a reset. Sports. I'm James Sabolski, and we will see you next time from Rickside.